All right, so I'm gonna take some time out of my day just to show you what I'm dealing with here. I got a 950, uh, pulled this switch box out and we're on the test. I did the test like three times. It failed every single time, but these are pretty expensive and uh, hard to find. So it's always worth, I think it's worth the gamble. And um, just for illustrative purposes, I just wanted to show you guys how to wire it up. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is make sure that you have a solid ground. Okay, so I have the uh, switch box grounded here, the coil grounded here, and then I have the uh, spark coming right back in right here. All right, and on this side, which I already know, don't tell me, I know this switch box looks like crap, but we're gonna jump with the white and the brown, and then on the black terminal, I just have a lead so I can just ground it. And then on the other side, we jump over the red and the white, and then of course connect the coil. And when you connect the power, since this is jumpered, connect to the white terminal, it'll provide power for both of these 12 volts. And then every time I ground this onto said battery, a spark should happen right there. Okay, yeah, and you can recreate re uh, this setup inside the engine. Um, but, you know, if it's mounted or whatever, I just did it this way because it's it's a little easier. But all right, so I'm gonna power up the switch box here. Then I'm just gonna make sure, just checking to make sure there's 12 volts that side, 12 volts that side. So I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so we're good. Now I'm just gonna tap this onto the ground. And every time you tap it, you should hear it snap. Can you see it? Here, let me turn off the lights. All right, so we're kind of working in the dark, but all right, there it is. So every time that trigger grounds, that's when the spark goes, and that's a that's a nice blue spark there. I like that. <laughs> so that's signs of a healthy switch box. Well, hope you enjoyed it. All right. So I just thought I'd take some time out of my day and uh, just show you what I'm dealing with. Um, I'm working on a 950 SS right now and a, a Tiger. It's a, it's a 90 cubic inch block. I mean, really beautiful. Great compression around 140, 150 PSI on all six cylinders. Um, and right now I just got no spark on all cylinders. So obviously I got a bad switch box. So, all right. Well, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. Otherwise, thanks for watching.